never getting out of this, Wake. Never! Don't worry. I'll take care of your wife and your life. think you're doing, but I'll send you right back to the beginning. When the dark man's eyes suddenly locked into Serena's, she flushed hot. They ignited a black fire in her. He was talking. He wanted the power turned off. He said something about the projector booth. She hooked a finger under his belt buckle. He grabbed a hold of her throat and twisted until it hurt. Somewhere deep inside, a part of her screamed in paralyzed horror. But the moan that escaped from her throat had no panic in it. Pay attention, he said. Business first. His eyes glittered shamelessly. Hers did too. What? You think whatever it is you're gonna do is gonna make a difference? This will end up just like before! It's obvious that for all his power, Mr. S*** is an agent of another greater being. The dark place he came from is full of terrible alien intelligences, dark presences, and none of them should be let loose in our world. He serves one of them. He'll open the way for them if I don't stop him. But he'll do more. He'll take over my life. He already has my face. He already uses my name. He'll become Alan Wake in every way imaginable and corrupt everything, unless I can stop him.
been around for a while now, you know? While well, you've been indisposed, stuck in the darkness. I've been busy. I operate in the shadows, not always literally, you understand? I'm a little more resilient than those I've taken, but I do my best work in the dark. Ugh. And there's so much darkness out there that goes deep, and the things that live in it are fast, big bastards. They don't mind getting a little bit of elbow room. All that chaos and madness, it doesn't really do that much down there. It's like pouring a glass of water into the ocean, right? But up here? Yeah, you can really make an impact. All they need is someone to bring them all the way through. But first, I had to take care of you, you party pooper. You're stuck in an eternal cycle now. The sun's never coming up for you. Everything else? Do my thing? Getting a bit of quality time with Alice? <laughs> That's a little something for me. And I deserve it. There's more to fighting the Taken than just burning away the darkness that protects them. When I'm fighting for my life, I find myself slipping into a state of intense concentration that makes the beam of my flashlight seem more powerful and focused. I used to think it was just my imagination, something brought on by the adrenaline and fear of death. But now I'm not so sure. I've been touched by powers that I can't begin to truly comprehend. And they've left a mark. I'm starting to think this might be a part of it.
Again, the Champion of Light enters the final trap. The new reality is almost here. All he needs to do is change the details of the scene, push it past the breaking point, and the rest will snap into place. events or merely a dream, a memory or a glimpse of what is to come. One thing is certain. This scene takes place in another time and another place far, far away from Night Springs. <laughs> 